Investigators say George Soros was not on the estate, and the suspicious package was immediately flagged by a caretaker who moved it to an open area away from people. Sources say the package was found in a mailbox and describe a pipe bomb made with explosive powder. A bomb squad, quote, rendered it safe. Luckily, no one was injured, and uh, there's no continuing threat that we're aware of. Soros is 88, a billionaire many times over who donates generously to Democrats and liberal causes. That makes him a frequent Republican target. Without offering proof, the president earlier this month claimed Soros paid protesters during the Kavanaugh confirmation fight. A spokeswoman for George Soros blamed, quote, the politics of hate for creating an atmosphere that promotes death threats and violence. I could not hazard a guess as to what entered into the minds, uh, the mind or minds of whoever is the perpetrator of this, clearly that's a sick and disturbed mind. The FBI is looking at numerous possible motives for the attempted pipe bombing. In New York City, the NYPD's Critical Response Command sent officers to properties owned by Soros. Added an abundance of caution is uh, we're in contact uh, with uh, people from the Soros uh, organization. The FBI and ATF are examining evidence, including surveillance video and pieces of the pipe bomb, as they work to catch the would be bomber. In Bedford, New York, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. And sources tell us it appears the package was not delivered by a mail carrier, but rather placed in the mailbox by the suspect or an accomplice.